Is wokeism determined to kill off Christianity once and for all? Sean Bailey, this is nuts. I'll tell you why this is important. Right, so you, you, you talked about the civil servants banning the use of the word Christmas. What's interesting is if you speak to anybody from any other religious mm. belief, they want to celebrate Christmas because they want you to celebrate Diwali with them yeah. and Eid and all the, all the rest of it. So people from a religious belief have no problem with other people's religious um, ceremonies mm. and, and, and events across the year. Where this is problematic is it feels like the thin end of the wedge. So if you remove a cross, then when do you remove yeah. the Muslims? Well, when you do you remove the Sikhs? You can't do that. Yeah, but, but it will happen, and that's where people start to get a bit nervous. They came for me, and I didn't defend them. When are they going to come for you? Mm. And I think people need to understand understand people's religion is fundamental to who they are yeah if we believe that we're civilized we should protect that not attack that and even a thing like this that seems small is a crucifix is it a cross is it a jc cross actually people have been using this symbol for 2,000 years. They know what it is by changing it. I think you, for them, you attack the religion. For me, you attack the religion. Everybody knows. How are they attacking the religion? Well, they're like, a Christmas it's a market. Crucif it's, well, yeah, it's they're a crucifix. They're still selling them. They're calling them JC crosses. And I but think they're when not JC crosses. More closely, it's, yeah. it's literally just they wanted to source more local produce. That's all they were kind of well, doing. This do is that. not woke. Oh, wow. This awesome. is not woke. <laughs> <laughs> Goodness <laughs> gracious me. My gosh. Well, Why Amy, not, Amy, Not everything Amy. comes back to what well, Amy, Listen, you wouldn't call the Quran the cube book, would you? Yeah. You just call it the Quran. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But they're having a Christmas market. Like, Amy, they love Jesus. Amy, they're having a whole festival for it. It might not be woke. It might not be politically correct, but it is stupid. And I think sometimes we just have to call things as they are. These are crucifixes. They're yeah. not JC crosses. I completely agree with them wanting to source more produce locally mm. and not get cheap imports from China. Yeah. Who could be angry at that? Crucifix. But calling a crucifix a JC cross, yeah. it's just stupid. I and why like... is it why is it the Greens that always come up with yeah, nonsense? And, and like a, 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 a Green French councillor doesn't get to rename the no. symbol of the Son of Man. No. It, it's just I don't not think right. They renamed it. It's just it's well, they did. Look, so what we it, need it, more it, it was called we have a crucifix. If you speak, and now it's called a JC cross. If you speak to the Pope, it a JC if cross? you speak to the Pope or the Archbishop of Canterbury, neither of them will use the word. Neither of them will use the words JC cross. They wouldn't. They wouldn't no. do it. This, it's not a JC Cross. Before you read this article, if someone said JC Cross, what would you have thought it was? I'd have thought it was Jeremy. a place in South London. Or Jeremy Corbyn's angry. Um, but, well, you're but, not erasing yeah. Jesus. It's still his, you know, it's yeah, place. But then my point Let's is, not get too upset about look, it. I'm not, sure they would, I'm not sure they would have done this at, you know, at, at other religious festivals, yeah. right? I do think that Christians, sometimes Christians, are deemed as easy targets because they just won't kick up a fuss. They're so nice. Yeah. Well... I Apart from the Crusades, to be fair. I think it comes <laughs> from some ill-judged sort of desire to be more inclusive. When actually I think you can be inclusive, but at the same time respect the traditions of a country and the religious traditions of where Christianity came from and how it's a quite important part of European culture. Let, I'm not even clear. religious and I no. think it's... Let's important. be clear, <laughs> it is the basis of European culture. Exactly. Our laws come from there. But more importantly, you are not inclusive by excluding the largest group. That doesn't make you inclusive. I just realised what this is. This is the annual, oh, they're coming to cancel Christmas, they're going to rename it well, Winter, they are a winter bit. Festival. But people do, but people and it's getting, do that, Amy. I can't that, believe that you're having this... It's, it's October every year. The debate comes earlier and earlier and earlier. It's fine. Christmas is safe. It's not going to be Winter Festival. Well, it Christmas isn't. If, is according to those civil servants, it isn't safe. Yeah. They wanted to, to ban the world. My, 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 my neighbours celebrate Eid all the time. Me and my children go out and celebrate Eid. Brilliant. They come and celebrate Christmas. There's no part of them that wants to get rid of Christmas. My, my, my neighbours light a lot of fireworks at Eid, so my kids yeah. are well up for it. Eid. They're well up for it. <laughs> but the point, the point, they are. My, my son loves it. Yes, but, uh, Eid. But, 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 the, but the point is, you've got to let people have their religious beliefs, have their, their, their traditions, and if you try to remove them yeah. and make us homogenous, what you'll do is just start people at each other's throat. I think the fact that we've been having this debate well, every year since, since Jesus Christ was born um, shows that Christmas isn't going to Well, I'm sorry, they talk about, you know, the, they, they, they're trying to wrap it up as this, oh, we want to cut back on the importation of cheap Chinese goods, right? Well, most masks, frankly, were from China, as far as I could tell. They weren't against them in Strasbourg. I'm sorry, but it, if the burqa was all made in China, they certainly would not be banning that in Strasbourg. Let me tell you that yeah. much. I don't all see all they need the to crop. do... Well, that's what tariffs are for. <laughs> if, you yeah. want, if you want to stop cheap crosses from China, get, put a tariff on them.